What's up y'all, it's Brittany all day in the cut and I'm back again with another video for y'all. Today I'm gonna be doing the get to know me tag so that y'all can get to know me a bit better. What I did was I googled get to know me tag questions. I just clicked on the first link that I saw here and I'm gonna answer the questions. Okay, so for starters, my name is Brittany Francesca. I'm from Peter Maritzburg. I currently live in Johannesburg. Would you rather trade some intelligence for looks or looks for intelligence. I would trade in some looks for intelligence because looks aren't all that because at the end of the day your intelligence will get you somewhere and your looks won't you know. If you could breed two animals together to defy the laws of nature what new animal would you create? I would combine a dog and a bear. Dogs are like friendly and stuff they always like want your attention and stuff and then bears are like scary and whatever so then the bear will have the dog's qualities and then you can chill and you can cuddle your bear dog thing you can cuddle your bear dog you know what i'm saying and then it'll be so cute because then the bear is almost like a teddy bear you know what i'm saying and then the dog always likes wants your attention so that i feel like those two would go together would you rather go 30 days without your phone or your entire life without dessert now if you know me you know that i love my dessert so i ain't giving that up and i can go 30 days without a phone I can, I can, I can, I can go 30 days without my phone, it ain't no biggie, 30 days isn't a lot, trust me, plus I do other things, I paint, I draw, watch TV, okay I don't watch a lot of TV, I can't sit still, what's the dumbest way you've been injured, now I have plenty of ways, like especially when I was a child, now that I'm older I don't really, the last time I think I got hurt was like, I think I was still, no I was still like in high school when I got hurt, the first one, would have to be like my skateboarding accidents. There's this um, there's a skateboard trick called the manual, right? I lift the skateboard up like this, so it's on. You riding on these back wheels here. I'm balanced on these two wheels. I'm going down the road. I'm like, hey, I've got the skateboarding trick, right? Then I lost my balance, so I'm like, okay, I need to go back down onto all of the wheels. As I go back down, just before I got back down, the one wheel came off. And I didn't know. Now the wheel is missing here. So the skateboard tipped like this. And it flips me over. And then I did like a whole front flip. And that day I wasn't wearing. What's it? Those knee, knee guard things. Knee guards, elbow guards. And a helmet. I wasn't wearing any of that. Because I thought I was an OG. Luckily I put my hands out. So I just landed like this close to the top. I just scraped my hands. I didn't injure my head or anything. What's something that someone would never guess about you? People would never be able to guess that I am friendly and I talk a lot. Because I really talk a lot, but it depends on who I'm around. If I'm comfortable with you, if I'm not comfortable with you, it depends. What would your parents have named you if you were the opposite gender? Um, my mother told me that she would have named me Jeremiah or Casey. But, what's your biggest accomplishment? Well, for now... I'd have to say, being true to myself, I've really discovered a lot about myself during my gap year and over the past two years of me studying at college. Being in that environment, I've, I've really discovered a lot about myself and it has helped me to stay true to myself. What inspires you? People that go out and get what they want and do what they want. People that make things happen for themselves. They don't sit around and act like a loser, like a sore loser, carry on like a sore loser and be like, oh, I can't do nothing for myself. Um, yeah, my life sucks, blah, 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 blah. Like, I used to be that person that used to be like, ah, oh, if only this and that would happen. If only I was like this, then this would be so great. Now, fam, now I'm just like, I try to, you know make a lot of stuff happen by myself if i can do it by myself without anyone's help then i'll do it i'll make that thing happen like now what's your favorite childhood memory i would have to say we should stay in like this big complex like i don't know how many units there were they probably like a hundred units but yeah so now staying in a big complex as a kid it's like the best thing ever because then you have all these all these kids that you can play with right you have a lot of friends and then every like every Friday night, the stole all the whole complex, all the all the kids in the complex would meet up, right? And then we'd play hide and seek 
and hide and seek is lit with a lot of people play hide and seek play touches oh and then my favorite then we play knock and run what's your favorite music genre hip-hop and r and B. I i can't decide between the two i love hip-hop and i love r and B. what's your favorite sport my favorite sport soccer what's your favorite way to pass time i love listening to music i'm always looking for new music what is an ideal first date for you i would say like nothing nothing too hectic you know maybe movies and and like lunch or supper what is something you look for in a partner get your notebooks out smart sweet kind caring and a bomb personality because if you don't have those and you're just about your looks then I'm sorry you ugly to me, my friend. Like, no. I'm good, love. Enjoy. Okay, so I ran out of space on this phone I was recording on. So I'm just going to end the video off right here. Don't forget to like this video and drop a comment. Like, maybe I'll do a part two. But I think, I'm thinking in future, I'll ask on Instagram for people to ask me questions for the, for the next video. So if you want me to do a video, then make sure that you look out. I'm gonna put my Instagram link, my Instagram handle right here. And then you can like look out for when I post that. And then you'll ask me questions that you want me to answer in the next video. Yeah, so I'll see you guys next time.